Hey guys, today I'll show you how to host WordPress website on Ubuntu 24.04 LTS using a free control panel called Cloud Panel. So let's start. Go to Auto Host and navigate to hosting. Go to VPS Hosting. Scroll down and choose your VPS plan. I suggest get at least 4 GB of RAM. So just click Order and you can choose your billing cycle if you will choose annually up to annually you can save somehow so if you want to choose annually you get at least 406.8 discounts and choose your server location i uh, usually choose uh, the us because my audience are from the us and i'll choose um, la or uh, new york so i'll choose uh, los angeles and scroll down be sure to choose ubuntu 24 point zero four lts this is an lts and you can choose none because we will install cloud panel so scroll down and i have nothing to add here just continue and pay your auto host vps and once you have paid your uh, vps auto host will send you your details for your uh, vps the control panel and access details to your server so i will go to my control panel i am now on my control panel and we will log in using a free SSH client called Bitdevice to connect to our server. Scroll down and you will see your IP address. Okay, just copy this one. Download and install Bitdevice. Okay, just put your IP address here, set host, and use port 22. Username will be root. Okay, just click login and scroll down. Go to server information and copy this password and paste it here. Go to terminal console and we are on our server and we run, we currently run Ubuntu 24.04 LTS. Next, we will install Cloud Panel. So I will go to Cloud Panel first. Okay, so just copy this command so that we can update our packages. Paste it here and hit enter. Okay, we have finished grading our system and let's go back to Cloud Panel and let's install Cloud Panel with MariaDB 10.11. Here, we will be choosing 24.04 LTS because it's the latest. Just copy this one and paste it here. Right click and hit enter. Okay, we have finished installing Cloud Panel and let's access our Cloud Panel using this IP address with port 8443. So just go to your favorite browser and paste it here. Just paste and go. Click Advanced and click Accept the Risk and continue. Okay, we will create an admin. I'll just say Bruce Wayne. Bruce Wayne. I'll say Bruce at webchunks.shop. I'll set the secure password and just choose your time zone. Uh, click agree to the license terms and just create user. Okay, let's log in. Okay, we have successfully installed Cloud Panel and let's go to dashboard. Here we have our operating system name. So it is Ubuntu 24.04 and our public IP is here and we have at least 4 GB of RAM which is sufficient for hosting multiple WordPress websites. Now let's configure our cloud panel. Instead of using this naked IP, we will use our own domain to access cloud panel. Just go to admin area, go to settings, and we will set a custom domain. It will be a subdomain and be sure to add an A record before saving this one to issue a free let's encrypt certificate. So I'll just set this to cp.webshanks.shop and I will go to my domain register. I'll go to Cloudflare. Okay, I'll log in first. Okay, I will use webshanks.shop. I have added this a while ago and it already propagated. Okay, I'll just go to DNS and I'll add my custom domain for our cloud panel. Okay, so I have a record at the moment. I will set this IP address to our current IP address first. So just copy this one, click to copy, click edit and paste it here. So we have an A record already. So we will use this to access our WordPress website later on. Okay, add record, it will be A, so it will be CP, a subdomain, and IP address. Just click save. 
Okay, let's go back to our cloud panel. Let's try to save this one. Okay, perfect. If you are using Cloudflare like me, be sure to go to SSL first. Set this custom SSL TLS to full. Okay, let's go back to DNS. And now we will access our cloud panel using this custom domain. I'll just paste this one here. Okay, we will log in. Okay, now we have accessed our cloud panel using our custom domain. Now let's add a WordPress. So let's begin creating our WordPress website. Go to add site here. Click create WordPress site. I'll be choosing webshanks.shop first WP and just click create. Okay, perfect. And be sure to store this on a safe place. Just paste it right here. Okay, let's go back to sites. Okay, let's click this domain and go to SSL TLS. We will be using a self signed, so no need to add a new Let's Encrypt certificate because Cloudflare handles this self signed. And we will add a triple W version for our domain. So let's go back to our DNS provider. But first, I'll set this proxy. So let's turn this one on and we'll add www copy this ip and hit save let's wait for a moment for the dns to propagate okay now let's try to access our website okay perfect we have our first wordpress website on ubuntu 24.04 lts and we are using a self-signed certificate by cloudflare okay now let's log in using our credentials okay we will use admin as our username let's copy this password Okay, perfect we are now here on our wordpress website so let's try to install a theme let's add a new theme let's try cadence okay, let's install this one let's activate okay, let's install ai powered themes okay let's use a classic starter it will be faster for our this tutorial let's scroll down and try to see if there is free okay, okay let's try this one Click next, we'll import the full site. Okay, let's launch, start import. Okay, let's see our website. Okay, perfect. We have now a functioning WordPress website. You can just customize this one of your preferred configuration of your WordPress website. And now you can install whatever plugins you want to install. So my top two favorite plugins I must use is a security plugin and a backup plugin so that's it i have created a wordpress website on ubuntu 24.04 lts and let's create another website so let's go back to cloud panel okay dashboard okay let's go to site add site create a wordpress site this time i'll be using webshanks chat online will be second w P uh, on two twenty four point zero four. Let's try online because we have a duplicate site user. Okay, just click create. Okay, as usual, just copy this credentials. I'll just create a new tab for this credentials. And let's go back to sites. Okay, let's click this one. Go to SSL TLS. Let's go back to our Cloudflare. Okay, overview. So let's go to webshanks.online. Okay, go to DNS. Okay, we have already an A record. Let's set this to our IP address. Let's go back to cloud panel. Okay, just copy this one. Paste your IP address here. We will use proxy. So just save. Okay, let's add a www version and just click save. Let's go to SSL. TLS, scroll down. Okay, let's configure. Scroll down and be sure to choose full and hit save. Let's wait for a few minutes for this DNS to propagate. Okay, let's try to access our second WordPress website. Okay, perfect. Let's log in. Okay, let's go to our credentials. Our admin password is so admin your password and hit enter okay let's try to install a new theme let's try cadence install activate let's try to start a template. ok 
Okay, let's install theme. We'll use a starter template. Let's try this one. Hit next, hit next, and launch. Okay, let's see our site. Okay, perfect. So if you want to add more WordPress websites, just follow my step-by-step -step guide for this first and second WP. So just rinse and repeat. So that's it. This is how you will host multiple WordPress websites on Ubuntu 24.04 LCS using a free web hosting control panel called Cloud Panel. If you have any questions, just comment them down and I'll try to answer them all. If this video helped you in any way, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you on my next video.